What's up YouTube? Kyle here to bring you guys another video. I'm sorry if the audio quality is going to be a little lower on this one. I just, I, just for this video, I just wanted to do a review on this jacket and I want it to be more maneuverable, maneuverable let's say. But yeah, so I got here, this is my review on the uh, Columbia Pike Lake hooded jacket from obviously Columbia, right, as you can see. So I did cop this about a week ago and I've been using it for about a week and I've just been super happy with the purchase. Um, this is basically like a winter jacket. Uh, I was kind of like looking for a new jacket sort of for spring slash uh, fall use because I live in Canada and it's mad cold out here. So yeah. And my other, uh, my North face is like getting damaged and I usually use it for spring and fall. It's like a wind, it's a gourd, uh, I don't know what model it is, but for the North Face it was like a gore uh, wind something 550 downfill. It's a good jacket but not really great for like spring slash for spring like Canadian weather because Canadian weather basically is like two, fall, two winters basically so I don't really consider Canada having two like a spring where it's very like short spring then it goes into summer but yeah so I did buy this it's more of a winter jacket but yeah but as again I live in Canada so it's cold so yeah so this comes in a, a black colorway um, this is the like dark gray slash white or light gray colorway that I got. There's another one that's a uh, navy blue with royal blue at the bottom. It was actually really nice going through it again, but yeah, I'm really happy. And then the other colorway that's on the site, on the Canadian website, is uh, it's a black slash red. It might be orange, but it's, but like the other colors were previously allowed. This itself, it stands out. This is why I got this one. Normally I go for all black, but I always have like black jackets anyway, so ended up picking this. This was half off because uh, Columbia is having a winter sale. So this was like half off. Uh, Canadian, it goes for 200. And then I was able to get it for 100. Well, and then before taxes and shipping. So it's like 120 after tax. Uh, it's definitely worth the value because I was wearing my brother's like Canada Goose just to compare. Like, don't get me wrong, the Canada Goose is definitely a bit warmer. Like, I have to try the Canada Goose out more, but uh, it's heavier, but this is lighter. And this is warm. Like, all throughout uh, being outside in the weather, it's been, like, negative 18 with wind. Uh, it make, The wind makes it, like, negative, feel like negative 18. But, yeah, I ha I've never felt cold in this jacket. And I'm just going to go through the details of the jacket itself. Uh, yeah. So, Columbia here. I've been really liking their their stuff. It's just because I have the Columbia socks and like I've just been using those like during the winter time and I've been like super warm in them. So I was just like, hey, let me just try out this brand. I usually would go North Face. I was gonna try to buy, again, I was just in the, in the market for a jacket just for like an everyday type of used jacket. So that's why I would normally go North Face, but I like, hey, Columbia was like, was on sale so it's just like I'd rather cut cost like cut expenses down because life obviously but yeah let me just pull this down or so one of the things I was looking for was like um, a really warm jacket that was rainproof and snowproof because obviously the snow it's gonna stow sometimes and I wanted something that will like last a while like the outer shell is nice it's really soft it's really soft uh it's not like rugged like some of my other winter jack my other winter jacket has like a rough uh liner on the outside so like it feels like the the water would come off from rain or snow but like for so far i haven't used this in snow or i did but like i've never really had any problems with like the water getting in the inside but yeah i'll open it up more afterwards and just see if i can open this up let me yeah so for the pockets let's just go through the pockets the pockets are right here through the jacket 
they're actually pretty deep. You can put a lot of stuff in here. Like, I put my gloves, my phone. I can put, like, another phone if I had another phone. And then, like, headphones. But, yeah, I don't want to keep carry a bunch of stuff in one pocket just in case it all drops out randomly or something like that. But, like, it's really deep. And then there's, like, a lining on the inside. Or can't really show you. See? There's, like, a lining on the inside here that keeps your hands warm. Granted, it's not going to be, like, amazingly warm, but, like, when I was outside stuff waiting for a bus, like, uh, I think it was, like, about 10 minutes, like, I had my hands in there, I had no gloves on, I, even though I had gloves, I was just, like, I was gaming on my phone, so I was just, like, didn't want to have gloves on, so, yeah, but overall, my hands were warm, so, definitely good, other side pocket, side pocket, well, I never really pulled this in. Oh no, this is a zipper, my bad. <laughs> yeah, and then the hood, the hood here. It's a pretty big hood. I've covered my head over it, like, I haven't been wet. Like, I'm, as I said, I've never been cold in this jacket for, like, the whole week I've used it. And I've been putting it through, like, cold weather, but yeah. Right, so we open it up. So the technology this jacket uses for the Pike, like, hooded jacket it uses omni heat so omni heat thermal reflective uh like their, their technology um i couldn't go into further detail on it just because i think it's more on the website it explains more but obviously for myself i just like i just like shiny things because it's reflective but it kept me warm i was just like okay you obviously want to try different products because like obviously cost but yeah, obviously, it depends on like how many reviewers do Columbia jacket. This is one of the reasons why I wanted to do a review on this jacket. Just because I didn't see much reviews or too many in-depth reviews on the product. Or I wasn't looking too much. But definitely does keep you warm. Like if it keeps me warm and like feels like negative 18 and I feel like, like a toasty blanket when I'm wearing it, it's, it's definitely a good product. Comparing to like, it's just a little like less warm than a goose. And that's like one of those like hardcore goose, the hardcore Canada goose. I'm just like, hey, I offer this because I only spent a hundred bucks, you know, a hundred Canadian. Like maybe an American is probably a lot, like maybe it'll be 70 American or something after conversion or something like that. But it's definitely cheaper. Granted, that was on sales. 200 Canadian, so it's probably like 100 something USD. Right. And then there's a pocket here. Pocket here is also uh, really. It's. You can fit a lot of things inside. Uh, I was able to fill a lot more than my uh, North Face one, but my North Face has like two pockets uh, or a bunch of different pockets. But yeah, it's definitely a good product. Uh, let me just turn this around. I'm going to put this on so I, you guys can see how it looks. Yeah, so this is how it looks like on my myself. Like on my body. Uh, forgot to say sizing. This is a size large. It's It's actually oversized, but not like too oversized uh i'd say if you want to like um if you want more of a what's it called like a um what's it called true to size fit like if you want it to be more tight you could go down a size but like on the website it says get true to size so i got true to size like for me i look mad bulky when i wear it but it's just because i'm chunky so that's also that also could be one of the reasons why i'm more warm <laughs> and but yeah i'm wearing a roots uh a roots uh sweater as well i was wearing a roots sweater the whole time i was wearing this jacket so yeah this is definitely warm but like i never felt cold in this jacket at all yeah this is the fit yeah if you guys like this video comment everybody subscribe like this video share it if anyone feels like they uh What's it called? Want to pick it up? Check it out. You know, if anyone wants to buy a jacket for cheap, 
Yeah, I'm just gonna zip this up and I'll shoot. Yeah, so this is how it's like when it's closed. I'm wearing a hat inside just because my hair is like messed up, so yeah, I don't wanna <laughs> show my hair. But yeah, it's definitely fresh. Definitely stands out. That's one of the reasons why I bought it. But yeah, see you guys again in the next one. Again, like, comment, subscribe, share this video. Uh, peace out.